My scientific self is buzzing with excitement, so much that I had to share a recent encounter I had with a special species in the wilds of Florida. This species has a snout that looks like a hedge trimmer. Yes, if you guessed it, I encountered a small tooth sawfish. The small tooth sawfish is an endangered species. It is incredibly rare to find this species in the wild, especially the adult sawfish. My wife and I were just out exploring an argy new near the shoreline of the Gulf of Mexico. We stopped to walk in the shallows and just moments upon our arrival started spotting the sawfish. It was crazy. Oh! <laughs> Okay, bye. <laughs> when we got home, we quickly reported our sightings to the Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission. But scientific me needed further study of these sawfish, so we went back to the same site a week later. We arrived hours before high tide and waited. And sure enough, when the waters of the Gulf of Mexico rose to meet the inlet waters, creating a shallow bridge, it was such a joy to watch this amazing species. That long toothy snout is called a rostrum and is used like a sensory tool to detect and stun prey. Prey is then quickly sliced up before consumed. Although sawfish look like sharks when swimming, they are more closely related to stingrays because their gills are located on the underside of their bodies. They also have that cute little mouth. Sawfish can grow incredibly large, reaching up to 17 feet long, yet they begin their life at only two feet. Sawfish are endangered because their rostra easily gets caught in fishing gear and they reproduce slowly, making population recovery difficult. Today, they are protected Protected, and sightings in the wild are rare, which makes observing one a truly special encounter.